especially if you're a manifestation person, which I am. I am always living in the end and trying to visualize and doing my affirmations and just like manifestation, blah, 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 you know, all of that, which I think is great. And I think it's so important. And I loved that aspect of my life and like building faith and spirituality and stuff. Like, I love it. It's been amazing. It like keeps me going seriously. But I think it's important to also face reality and to also let reality settle in. And when you're in a manifestation mindset at all times, it's really easy to forget what's currently happening. And when you forget what's currently happening, you can bypass and miss some of your accomplishments. And I definitely think I've done that, especially being in London. Like I told you, I was really depressed like months before this and just upset and not happy with where I was and what I was doing and feeling like I'm not making progress towards anything and whatever whatever and just like sitting here reflecting today in therapy and journaling whatever it's like sure valid in those feelings 100% valid but I've accomplished things while here and I'm living in a manifestation that I set back at home but I'm too busy thinking about the next thing that I can't enjoy this current thing when it's like reflect think about what you're currently doing this time last year i was doing manifestations to be a published writer i used to look in the mirror and be like i am a published writer i'm a published writer and i didn't know when it was going to happen how it was going to happen and then i now have three publications in a year so it's like i have to thank myself for that and be proud of myself for that because i have not let myself realize that like while i've been upset because i'm here I haven't acknowledged all the great that has come from being here. Just want to get that little tidbit. Especially if you're a manifestation person, you like thinking about the future and thinking about the next thing. You also have to be happy in the current thing and acknowledge the current thing because I'm sure what you're doing is great right now, but it's so easy to forget that you're doing something great when you're just wanting the next thing. And it's okay to want more and see more for yourself but it's also really important to be thankful and show gratitude and be proud of yourself for what you're currently doing and like give yourself shout outs every now and then like i i it's actually like blowing my mind that i forgot how big of a deal it was to be published like i think especially in a writing program you just forget because a lot of people are published or it's just kind of like a normal common thing that you forget that it's actually a pretty big deal and like a year ago I wasn't published a year ago this is exactly what I wanted exactly where I wanted to be oh fuck those people just scared the shit out of me Whew. okay but I, I think you know what I'm saying